Bismillah ar-Rahman ar-Rahim with the name of Allah who is very kind and merciful. Welcome to DevOps King channel. In this channel you will find the solution of different tasks about the DevOps. Today we shall discuss how to configure the external user access for the Azure DevOps. If you need any help please contact on this WhatsApp number about the Docker Kubernetes Terraform CICD. All videos prepared by certified DevOps engineer on this channel. In order to subscribe on this channel, please search for the DevOps King. You will find the logo DevOps King. Please click the subscribe button so that you can get the notification about the latest upload on the channel. Today, our topic is to access the external access for the user in Azure DevOps. So if, in this case, first of all, we shall click on the organization. We shall click on the organization. And after that, when you select the organization, then at your bottom, you will get the organization setting. Then you will click on the organization setting. First, you will select the organization after that at the bottom you will click on the organization setting in the next step in the next step you will select the click on the policies enable the external access if you check on the left side you will find the link of policies when you click on the policies link on the right hand side you will enable the external access you can see in this pen after enable the external access, the next third step is, the third step is when you select the user link, then on the right hand side, you will find the button of add user, this button, you will find the add user button. When you click on the add user button, you will find the form to add the user like this one like this one this form will appear when you click on the add user button in this button first you write the username then you uh, uh, select the access then you select the project and if you want to send the email then you will say click the check box and uh, at the last you will click on the add button like in this form First of all, you will write the username. After that, you will define the access level like the basic. It may be admin as well, depend according to your requirement. And here you will select the project. For the project, you want to access the external user. And after that, you will check this checkbox. When you create the access of that user, user will get the email. And at the end, you will click on the add button when you click on the add button our new user will be added in the user section like in the next section the section 5 is when you come here then you will click the user link when you click on the user link you will find the user that we have added in this project this is the part one of our series for the external access in the next lecture we shall configure it for the team project so that the new user can do some work on the selected team project see you in the next lecture